And it's Dominique, and I'm going to show you a demonstration of how to use the Sizzix Big Shot, which is a lot bigger than my little sidekick down there. I'm borrowing this from a friend, and it's really cute. It's very heavy, so there's no um, suction cup or anything on the bottom like the sidekick has. It's black and pink, and there's a little sparkly gem on the end. But the main thing is that it holds bigger dies, uh, thicker ones as well. So as you can see, much thicker and much bigger than a sizzlet die. And this is a package of three. So, all right. So what I did was I layered my paper. Um, that's another good thing about the Big Shot is that you can cut more than one piece of paper at a time, which is fabulous if you're doing alphabets, if you want more than one copy of the same colored shape for various cards, you know, you name it, you can do it with this thing. Okay, and this also cuts fabric as well. So, let's see. See if, yeah. And there's even a handle on top as well. Okay. I don't know if you noticed, but I put the die cut in the center of the two cutting pads. That way it was even on both ends and it makes it easier to roll it through the die cutting machine. Same thing goes for the Sidekick and I imagine any other brand. You want to put your die cut in the middle if it um, doesn't fill the full shape of the cutting boards. That way it's even and it will go through much easier than having to fiddle with it. So let's take a look. I need some snowflakes. I figure I may as well prepare for uh, next year's Christmas cards. I suppose this year's Christmas cards. Nice crisp cut. And then all I have to do is just poke at that other shape. You could laminate these and hang them as Christmas tree ornaments. Because most card stock and paper is acid free and pretty safe for kids to eat if they happen to do that, or pets. So you just take your shape and gently wiggle it out. I did three layers, so that's why it's a little picky. Hopefully I don't rip anything. But you can use these as tags for gifts. Because they're snowflakes, you don't have to use them for Christmas. You can use them for anything that happens in the winter. New Year, birthdays, anniversaries, Valentine's Day. And they're homemade. And everybody loves something handmade, regardless of what it is. This one's really giving me a fight here. Oh. And there we go. And that is how you use... <coughs> Oops! <laughs> That's how you use a big shot. Thanks for watching.